Well, if that story got your heart racing, you're not the only one. And of course, if it was too fast, this is what I'd be using to check you out. But now there's a new way to detect heart problems using a smartphone. Dr Peter Bentley is the creator. Peter, how does it work? Well, it's pretty simple. I, I've written an app which turns an ordinary smartphone like this into a stethoscope. So it, it does a little, a few clever things, but it allows you to uh, listen to the very deep, the very low sounds, the very quiet sounds corresponding to your heart. So is that using the microphone in the smartphone? It is. It's using the built-in microphone. It's an incredible app. Can we actually see it in action? It certainly can do. Here is a very good place to listen. It's very clear, isn't it? And how does it help diagnose heart problems? Well, it has um, two interesting features that cardiologists actually asked me to add to the app. Um, one of them is the ability to email out the audio. So you can uh, potentially be anywhere in the world. So you might be in a remote village, you might be somewhere, you know, perhaps your family doctor actually covers a massive area. It's very hard for you to get in mm. um, and see him. So how much better would it be if you could use an ordinary phone, sample the sound of your heart and just email it to your doctor? So a, a second option is also the ability to see the, the audio. So it maps the audio onto a visual display, which in fact, here's one that we just did. So um, you can see these individual spikes. And the spikes correspond to the volume and the frequency of the sound. And this is actually used by specialist cardiologists to help understand whether your heart is working correctly or not. So if you've got an extra heart sound, you know, it might be a boom 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 instead of a boom boom. So we're asking specialist computer scientists, can they write software that will automatically distinguish between normal and abnormal sounds? If they can do that, then hopefully we'll be able to add that kind of software to the app in the future. And then when someone samples the heart sound, they'll be able to ping up. You might want to see a doctor or you're fine. Thank you very much, Dr. Bentley. And if you want to find out more about this or any other story that we're covering on The Health Show, go to our website at bbc.com slash healthshow, where you can also find out how to get in touch with us online, as well as loads of other useful links and information.